Hey guys, Jason Bainey here today, and I'm going to show you an awesome little piece of kit from Really Right Stuff that they call the SC-ARC. All right, so it's a funny name for this little guy, but it is quite valuable, especially these days where there's a whole lot more ARCA options. Uh, I see in front of me, uh, this is a actually a prototype uh, Accuracy International ATX chassis with uh, a Voodoo in it, and they have a full ARCA rail there. Uh, you can also add pick with their key slot attachments. Massive amount of available chassis now with the ARCA, uh, the ARCA 4N, including the Bergara MG light behind me, otherwise known as the mag light, but they can't say that. The Seekins HIT rifle. This is the HIT Pro with the ARCA rail. And then up here is the AIAX with the uh, replacement handguard and it has the integral arca as well as the really right stuff uh, replacement fore end which has full arca so what that does is let you clamp anywhere along there uh, whether you're shooting from a tripod or whether you attach your bipod with arca so now to what this little guy does so what i have here are uh, an atlas bipod and a Thunder Beast. So this is the BT-65, this is the Thunder Beast. And these both attach to Picatinny rail mounts. But if you want them to go on the Arca, you just get this little guy. So again, it's called the SCARC, that's the part number. And this basically replaces the Picatinny clamp and gives you full run of all of these ARCA rails and also has a little R-lock pin if the ARCA dovetail is equipped with the holes for the R-lock. So I will actually show you how to mount one of these on the bipod because it's very easy. So here's the Thunder Beast. Take our Allen wrench. Two screws out. I want to save those screws. So there's the part right there. And you'll see the groove on the bottom articulates with that nicely. And once you get the right direction, it'll match up. So put the same screws back in. You can use Loctite if you really want to. I'm not going to for now. And that is how quick you've just converted your existing bipod to fit on an Arca. And, oh yeah, I didn't mention another little bit. Nested down in here like several of the other uh, really right stuff heads. You can also attach this to a Picatinny rail. So you didn't lose your Picatinny ability. You gained your Arca. So it can do pick or Arca, same mount. Uh, and again, if you look at uh, the hit rifle here, every two inches underneath there are, I believe, five millimeter holes is what the spec is on the R-lock. And what that lets you do is slide the bipod along the pick rail if you need to move for whatever obstacle you're shooting off of. So you may not want it all the way out. Um, but basically, brief overview then, now that this is mounted on the bipod, one two little levers over here, a little seesaw lever. First one lets you get out here to 90 degrees and that loosens the clamp. Then this little guy, the back of the seesaw lever, disengages the R-lock. So this is how you would traverse back and forth on the rail. You can also, it's, it's actually designed to fully flip the lever all the way, disengages it, 
you slide it, then you can go back and lock tight. So we got the seesaw lever and the main lever which loosens the clamp. So in the middle position here, the R lock is still up. This is loose. And if you want to disengage the R lock, you flip the lever the whole way, or while it's there, you can just lift up on that as well. So it's meant to run the whole course here, depending on what you need. Face directly, so we go. So again, handy little kit, piece of kit from Really Right Stuff can still mount on uh, Picatinny or Arca and it basically replaces an arms type mount. That's, that's the prescription for it, uh, which is shared by the Atlas bipods, the Thunder Beast bipods, and I believe the Magpul bipods, but I don't have any of those. So uh, just a, a very handy piece of kit that I recently discovered and wanted to, to share the information because I think a lot of you will find it very handy and will will be happy to realize you don't have to go buy new bipods necessarily. You can just get this and modify the ones that you want to use uh, on the Arca rails. If you do want to grab one of these mounts, there will be a link in the description for purchase. I do have them available to ship. They are 160. And again, you will just take off your existing mount, put this one on, and you will be ready to go Arca and Picatinny with Arlock. All right, thanks for watching. And if you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe. And we will see you on the next one. Brand new. Oh, yeah, we got to start over because that beanbag needs to go.